What's up guys, DWK videos. If you are new to my channel, I highly recommend hitting that subscribe button. Otherwise, I will cry myself to sleep consistently. The only thing getting me through life are numbers on a screen. However, today, we're a bunch of cis white males. She was born a male, that's why I married her. But uh, we were born cis white males, <laughs> and we're gonna try some authentic, mmm, mmm, culture Asian food. We're gonna try Asian food. So there's the shop in our town. We live in San Diego. What is it called? What's the shop? Day So. So it is. That was fucking racist. Wow. You tried putting an accent on? No, I just said Day So. <laughs> We're starting over. Um, are you sure it's just Japan? I don't think this is just Japan. No, I said it, on the store sign it says Day So and then Japan underneath. Okay. Well, we have a lot of Asian cuisine that, I mean, they put little, because they know dumb cis white males are gonna try to make YouTube videos and explore their culture for views. But, uh, so they gave us little, you know, descriptions of what it might be. But the rest of the stuff we really can't understand and they're really basic descriptions. We're gonna go through and do a taste test. This is the first ever scene done on YouTube. No one on YouTube has ever done anything remotely close to this before. I wanna punch you in your face. So, starting off, we're gonna do this thing, which gives the description of white cream soda. Look at that, that's aesthetically pleasing when the and camera focuses on it. That open, crack open a cold one with the boys. As you guys know, um, really authentic in Japan is soju, so we're about to get drunk, my boys. Ah, oh, that's really good, you should try that. All right, next we have some milk tea. I fucking hate him. I wish I had like a. Oh my god. That's good, right? I wish I wish I had one of those extension mics I could put under her <laughs> mouth while she does the sipping sound, and it, th then it, this just becomes an ASMR. <laughs> uh, a, a mukbang ASMR. Mukbang. It's what's what mukbang. Mukbang. Bang. Mukbang. God, idiot. I don't know. These what, stupid cis saying? white born males. We're gonna crack this open now. This one, also a bunch of lettering, but obviously it's grape soda. It has pictures of grapes on it, and it has a printed description saying grape. So, keep that one off to the side, babe. Babe, only one product at a time. Unless they're sponsoring us. If these people, you guys, if you wanna sponsor DWK videos, we'll leave that there for the rest of my videos. That's not bad. Well, no, I like grape soda. It tastes different than off like traditional grape soda, like the Sunkist. What's the description say? Soda, product name, grape. Ugh. Oh. So the third one is Milk Tea Black. So as you guys know, I go to Tapioca Express all the time and my favorite thing to get is the Boba Milk Tea. Actually, that was my favorite thing. I, I get the Thai tea a lot, don't I? Okay, I get Thai tea more than milk tea, but starting off when me and Nikki, if you guys know Nikki MGTV, we used to live, what, 15 minutes away from each other or so? Probably like 20. We would go and get milk tea at Tapioca Express like every other night. Like consistently, he got me on the chocolate milk tea and then I switched over to Thai tea because it tasted more like coffee. So, I'm actually really excited for this. I don't know so much of my wife. Are you looking forward to this at all? It's probably, I don't know, I feel like you complain about everything, so. <laughs> okay, here we go. That does not smell like I'm gonna like it. It's it's too much tea -y and not milky. Like mom, you know? Ew. Like when I'm breastfeeding off a of mom and it just tastes like too much like pus instead of milk. Here's the motherfucking tea. So next up is this. It kind of looks like churros. Um, what do you what do you think that really looks like? I feel like I've ate this. Like, I feel like we have the equivalent of whatever this is in America. I just can't put my finger on it. Besides, like, looks like churros. Looks like cinnamon twist from Taco Bell, but like um, straight. And it's not cinnamon. It says fried saltiness. Rice crackers. Fried saltiness rice crackers. Whoever did the description needs to get fired. I could do so much better. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Don't rip it like that. See, you open this one. Use that. Okay, I want to test first since you did the drinks. Oh. Oh my god. Why'd you put why'd you pull that away from me? It smells like you farted. I was about to ask, did you fart? 
Give it to him. My dog, my dog looks like he's about to puke. He's sitting down eating it. All right, I try first. God, these stink. These stink really bad. They taste like, um, what is that pig grinds chips? Uh. You know what I'm talking about? The chips that are like pig grinds? I do not like these. Yeah, zero out of two. I don't even think Bruno ate it. Yeah, he did, but no, that's because he's, he's a chewing. dog. Yeah, he's still a dog. Has a little, uh, what is that, like a teddy bear drinking milk? Yeah. This looks like gum. Almost. Kind of looks like gum. They, they, come, they come looking like Starburst, just wrapped up. It's hard to get the taste of that other thing out my mouth first. I like these. It tastes like um those jelly, those popcorn butter jelly beans. Yeah, the shit from um um that game where it would be like it would either be strawberry or shit socks. And you had to guess what's that one where you spin it and there's two of the same color jelly beans and you both take them. Um, I don't know. Twister. That's what it's called. Nope. Right hand red. But okay. Eat a shit flavored jelly bean. Those are good. Japanese hair. So as you guys have seen this in the last episode 46 of Naruto when Gara fought Lee. Do you remember that episode? That is literally the episode. If you type in Naruto episode 46, it's when Gara fought Lee and got pieced up. Anyway. Um, anyway, you know I don't watch that. <laughs> okay. When you think of cotton candy in a bag, what, how do you picture it? Just a bunch of fluff? <laughs> <laughs> oh my, it looks like a magic eraser. <laughs> Yo, this is a giant tampon. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my God. Why is it full? It's compressed. Hey, babe, it looks like a tampon before you shred them. Cause that's what you guys do, right? It's like a, it's like a shredder when you insert it in there. <sighs> Was it worth me getting age restricted because of the last five seconds? I don't know. It doesn't taste like anything. It's literally a sugar pillow. Yeah. Good old diabetes. You know. US of A. Just look at this. It's a little like lumberjack with a um, candy. All right, bring it out, bring it out, bring, bring it out. Bring it out, bring it out, bring it out. So my, when we were in the car and we were talking about this, she didn't know what it would be. I literally predicted it perfectly. I mean, it, this one actually doesn't have the description, but I'm guaranteeing you the trunk, the trunk part is pretzel and the like, Brown part around it is chocolate. It's just pretzels and chocolate. Like I guarantee you it's gonna be. I love the wrapping. Oh, and they put a little like cartoon. They put a little Japanese oh, cartoon in there. You were totally wrong. It is like a little cookie and it's shaped like a little tree trunk. I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Uh-huh. How oh. fucking yes, I love these. You get in some sort of ambassador deal out of these. Yep. They give you like a code. Use yep. Brittany for 20%. That was way too over. They're all yep. right. Hell yeah. I like these. Why do you have to be like that? <laughs> these are the best ones yet. Okay. These actually are pretty good. I think it's because we like chocolate, so. All right, guys. No shit with this one. I kind of already taste tested it. So did my wife. So we're gonna make my dog taste test it. Here. Oh, hi, baby. Hi, baby boy. Welcome to our show. Hello, honey. Okay, ready, Bruno? You get first try. Ready, Bobby? Okay. Thank you. You let go. You gotta let go. No, you gotta, you gotta let go so he can eat it. Ah! No. Wait, Bobby. Wait, wait. Oh, he says it just melts in your mouth. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> it's so good, he says that. Which one are we doing first? Oreo type cookies. There you go. There you go, mama. Here we go, mama. <laughs> <laughs> Our dog's eating stuff. Oh, 
These are so fancy, they're individually wrapped. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. That's that's really nice. I I, I feel yeah. richer. Me too. Now that they've done that. Feel boot. Oh, Bruno, our guest show. Wait, 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 wait! Don't push him. Oh. Here you go. Up up. Up up. Up up. Melt in your mouth. <laughs> Melt in your mouth. It was so mouth. good he came back for more. Okay, <laughs> bye bud. Bye. This shit is so good. <laughs> it's like uh Cookies and Cream Hershey's bar. No no not Hershey's. Hershey's. That's what I said. Ten ten would recommend this white packaging. Just look for the cookie that looks like a half Oreo. So far, the best thing out of all of this was this this cookie. Whatever this is, dude, if you guys can find this anywhere, I literally have no idea what to type in, but if you can find this, that's the shit to go. If you're in San Diego, what is it called again? Go to Daiso. Look up D-A-I-S-O. So good and cheap. Just get them. Cheaper than Oreos and they taste just like Oreos. I wish we did this last because now it's not going to compare. Well, you never know. What the? God damn it. Why do we eat the good thing first? Fuck. It's good, but now I'm like unsatisfied. Me too. Like, this isn't bad. This would have been like the one to end it all. Yeah, and I said, this is, that's why I don't trust you running the show. I said, you pick. Well, that concludes our little Americans try shit that they can't pronounce. If you'd enjoyed it, leave a like, and I'll see you. In the next one. Next one.